All right, in 815, they're just, uh, you know, giving you this uh, uh, remove the punctuation thing, and then they're saying, oh, split, uh, you know, and, and uh, they have this dot, dot, dot stuff in there, so we'll, we'll try all that. Um, so here's the, um, here's the punctuation and remove punctuation. Um, and uh, now let's see, I'm looking at us. they do they've got the same remove function uh, um, ah okay so yeah um, they're pointing out that you could um, you could write all that punctuation down like that and then check uh, that it's not in punctuation uh, but there's actually a, a string uh, definition for that, so we'll just copy this whole thing and uh, go here, put that in, and so here we import string, uh, so we bring that uh, library of routines in. And so we make this definition remove the punctuation from S. Uh, S without punctuation equals. Now here, notice what they're doing. Uh, I had pointed this out earlier. Um, when they said, you know, you can't change a string, um, they're showing right here that yes, you can uh, by using um, uh, the uh, addition uh, command or, or you know tacking it on to the end uh, because see they're using uh, plus equals here well again you know and that's a that's a fine Python statement uh, I tend to try to make it um, much more obvious partly because I'm just not smart enough anymore to remember um, but that's what they're doing. So they're they're doing that concatenation, uh, just tacking the the um, uh, the letter on here, uh, and and so it just uh, repeats it afterward. And so uh, that's our function. Uh, it returns that. So now we need to give it some input. Well, they gave us this nice um, oh well so here you see they've got uh, um, remove punctuation from uh, this thing and uh, so we could try that now they do the test that you know um, I'll just do the remove puncture you know they say test uh, I usually just do a print uh, so you see we could print uh, put this up here oops there we go so um, Let's see, we've got uh, something messed up here. There we go. Um, so this should just print, hopefully, true. Because what we'll do is we'll get rid of the quotations, the comma, the um, exclamation point, the other quotations, this comma, and the period. So we'll run that. And it does indeed print true. And so, you know, I can test it that that way just by printing that uh, logical comparison. And so you see it it 
did it just fine and uh, and then we can even you know we can tack on their whole thing here of my story um, uh, about snake poop I guess well let's see I'll we'll take this whole thing down here um, and see if we get uh, output like theirs so we'll put that in we'll run that and there you go so they put the dot 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 in there to uh, uh, show this but uh, uh, but that's how long it actually is and um, so this is just you know this is a nice thing it shows uh, we can um, check this uh, string constant which is the punctuation constant and it would look um, you know similar well actually we should be able to let's try printing that out uh, let's see what happens uh, I tried printing it uh, so we'll do string dot punctuation. See what it says. And we'll run that. And there you go. See, it's got uh, uh, all those punctuation marks in it. And that's, so that's what it's checking against when it says uh, if the letter is not in there. It's checking to make sure it's none of those characters. Okay, so that's um, that's eight fifteen.